Hello everybody, it's Sifter again with another Geometry Arena run and today I'm gonna try the Magician class Let's level him up real quick and uh, I'm gonna play a normal run for now just to see the class and go through it and uh, just play the game a bit instead of, you know, going into Wanderer mode and taking another 30 days for this to complete Let's also maybe craft like a rune or two because why not? So, I'm not sure what the buff is, but let's get the reroll here, let's be done. Let's uh, let's throw these things away. Maybe we'll find something better. Max HP, begin with. Bullets gradually change to more damage. Not really a good one. Not really a good one. Start with Arsenal. Explosion? Explosive? What is this? Whenever you take damage, immediately detonate all grenades. Grenades, some parts, and upgrades, grenades, mines, whatever, gunpowder. Cycle, power ups, upgrades. What? If your mind isn't triggered, then you blink. Arsenal, every time you activate a power up, leave mines. Bunch of mind related things. Anyway, let's buy. You know what? Let's keep coins for senior. No, let's buy some random runes. Maybe we find something that's useful. HP, movement speed, body size. Start with intensified bullets. Bullet damage. Start with intensified bullets. Start with. Which is that bullets gain damage and also crit rate plus 10. Bullet damage 17%. I'm using this. I'm using bullet damage 17% more and crit effect 93. I could get, I could combine them actually. Let's uh, let's combine my the ones I'm using. Let's combine bullet damage, intensified bullet, and more crits with uh, whatever this is. Small cycle fuse with this thing. Let's go fuse these. Bullet damage 142. Nice. Start with intensified bullet. I would like to retain this. So this is a refuse. Nice, I now retain, I retained what I wanted. I do, do... Would I like to get intensified bullets or would I like to get more crit? I would say intensified bullets. I can find the crit elsewhere. So let's combine them for that. I understand how combining works now. So... And then I would like to combine this again with a bullet, with an upgrade that would give us something similar. But for now, there isn't, that isn't the case, so let's just equip this. This has become like a lot better. Let's equip it and uh, let's start. Maybe I can buy that, like buy two random runes. I got even a rare. Wait, can I sell this? I could sell this for 19. Wait, how much can I sell this, this one? I have an upgrade in 60, okay. So do you have something that I care about? Crit effect, missile upgrade probability is higher and they're cheaper. No, crit rate and body size also no. I would like to get the green ring, a green rune that would give us, I guess, bullet damage and whatever. Okay, anyway, that's gonna be it for the runes. Let's see what the magician does. You have a magic gun. This is passive. That automatically fires bullets that will rotate around. Press and hold shoot button or skill button to pull the magic gun closer or push it further. The maximum distance for magic gun is 20. The speed of pushing or pulling is 12 per second. Okay, so it's gonna happen pretty quick. I'm gonna stick to the same ones I always have. Huge crowd, fierce offensive and accelerated world. Plus elite challenge, triple fun for the bosses and puffer arena. Everybody's gonna become huge very quickly. Let's go with the Sian again because I have the critical effect already be boosted to extremely high amounts. So might as well go with that. The class itself gives us low HP, 3, fire rate 200, so very high. Bullet speed less, okay. Body size less, very nice. Crit rate less, crit effect less and less. Um, so this is an anti-crit build, but uh, I actually do care about crits, so otherwise I could go for... Ah, let's go for crits, who cares? Ooh, this is attacking really fast. And I like, whoops, and now we are... And now the bullet is like over there. Okay, I see how this goes. So this thing is like moving around and leaving bullets behind it. And then I can like move it outside and move it inside again. In each bullet it leaves, it goes like... So this thing moves around and shoots bullets backwards. Let's uh, let's up the challenge a bit. Let's make it an A at least and let's, uh, let's start. Oh, so the bullets move around with me. Good to know, good to know. Uh, maybe A was not a good idea? Ah, whoopsie. Let's restart. Let's go challenge, but let's make it a B. <laughs> yeah, one difficulty lesser, definitely gonna be a joke now, right? Definitely not. The only thing I have to do is avoid everything. Okay, seems like that this thing is a bit too slow. I don't have that much of attack speed. Let's have everything around me. 
be in a bit of a smaller cycle. I got hit. I need to create the cycle before I will be able to go in and attack the enemies. That is the trick here. And I definitely will need, most likely, not definitely, I will most likely need some attack speed. Okay, let's stay away please. Let's have a bit, a bit of a bigger cycle. Oh, the wall, okay, 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 I see, I see. I see the problem, I see the problem. The problem, the real problem is that your bullets can, can get destroyed from the wall. So you have to stay... It's okay, still learn the character. Let's restart. Let's go challenge. Let's go just see. Okay. Let's go again. Let's try this thing again. So as I was saying, the problem is twofold. First of all, puffer. Not really a good idea for this character as enemies are going to become bigger and I'm going to have less room. Yeah, okay. Let's try this again. <laughs> Maybe, maybe remove some difficulties. Yeah, I, I don't need to chase down stars. This is giving me more stars, right? Yeah, I don't need to chase down stars. So let's remove the bosses being extremely powerful. Let's make the enemies a bit slower. Uh, I'm going to keep the huge crowd and I'm going to keep the buffer arena because it's fun. And uh, let's try this again. Okay, let's go challenge C again. This time with a bit less difficulties though bit fewer enemies are not gonna be dashing through the universe and also i will be able to you know set up a bit more they are still becoming huge but it's okay i was saying the difficulty with this character is that the bullets actually get destroyed by the walls so you either have to have a small cycle or you have to avoid the wall walls altogether in any case both of them are a downside i like create bullets I'm, I'm becoming huger, small and big, small and big. Yeah, it's a bit weird. I think I'm in wonder mode. No, 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 no. I don't want to be in wonder mode. Guys, I'm sorry. I do not want to be in wonder mode. Let's just get through with this. I want to go into normal mode. Um, I, I don't want more wonder mode right now. Let's go and uh, main menu. Start. Go into normal difficulty. And uh, this time, let's maybe do it challenge let's go again for a c let's see if this is also as difficult as the wonder mode or if it's like a lot easier it seems to be a lot easier no the elites still are pretty survivable the same i i try to find where my middle ground is where my best place is first of all this character definitely needs range like range is one of the most important aspect of him at least that's what it feels like Track missiles, bullet speed, critical rate, bullet size. Crit rate and bullet size. Whenever your bullets crit, you have a chance to fire a missile. Um, yes. And also make the bullets smaller. Yeah, let's make the bullets be a bit slower. Uh, bullet speed more. No, let's go. Fight. Actually, to be honest, I think upgrades that I would like on this character is when the bullets do something splitting etc splitting bullets would be nice i made the bullets slower so that they stay longer with me i think that is like one case where bullets being slower is actually helpful that was fast let's go into the store crit rate bullets blink to random position at six percent range this is such a bad idea ah oh, this is such a bad idea let's try it let's try it let's yolo let's see how this looks Uh, let's go. Let's upgrade the challenge level to A. Do I have damage? Every time you activate the power up heal one, might as well. Let's go. This is such a joke. But at least I'm shooting bullets out now and I don't only have my particular cycling bullets. And also the bullets I'm shooting out, they're not going into the wall. They're also cycling randomly around. So it's not like my random bullets are completely useless. But it is leaving a hole in my defense. <laughs> this is so fun. Elastic grenade. Greenies can rebound. Who cares? Crit effect and knockback. Take those and let's continue. I prefer to keep my money for when I need an elite. And I also would like to get some free rerolls. So that's the reason why I didn't reroll for zero. Because if I rerolled for zero and found an, um, a legendary that I wanted, 
then uh, I would have to lock down the shop because I would not have enough money to buy it. Let's maybe make the cycle a bit smaller. Store. Crit rate, bullet size, whenever you defeat a boss, generate mines. Nope. Let's get the reroll. Uh, fire rate, yes. Whenever you have 1 HP, yes. I would say yes to that. Less range. This is really dangerous with this character. Uh, this is 6 health though. So let's buy the 6 health and let's go. I know it has a downside associated with it. Let's actually make this a bit bigger. Yeah, I just need range. If I get some range on this character, then I will have my full circle again. And uh, after that, I think I don't need anything else. Range and attack speed, I think, is this character. Range and attack speed. Do you see Do you see the end of the line, like, splitting? It's as if um, the thread goes and uh, destroys itself. I don't know. Let's go level up. Let's go to the store. Bullet size, bullets, bullet speed, bullet size, and recoil. There is no recoil on this character. Bullet speed, no range and recoil. Ah, range, I would say yes. Range is what I cared about there. Bullet speed, no. I don't want bullet speed in this in this for this character at all. After taking damage, uh, power up will be generated. If your HP is equal or less than 5%, I don't understand why these little percentages, like 5%, what's 5%, man? I have like 15 HP, so it's here in the end. Bullet damage, but knockback. Yes. Let's continue. Now I have a bit more bullet damage, so the difficulty should still be easy. I see some enemies surviving with 1 HP. I'm not even moving. I'm the center of the universe. Let's make my cycle a bit bigger. Let's make my cycle a bit stronger. I can like make my cycle big and small and big and small. Store. Mine refresh will be free. Uh, this is gonna save me a small amount of money, I would say. Whenever you defeat an elite fire grenade towards a random enemy. No, let's let's take the free reroll. It's gonna save me like I don't know. 20 money? 30? Well, if it costs 40 and it gonna well, maybe it was a bad idea. Bullet damage, movement speed, but less HP. I would say yes. Let's get some damage in. Lose 2 HP, who cares. I would like to get some attack speed though, and some range. Let's get like half range on this. Yeah, that's pretty decent. I can move around even. I don't need to be stationary. Let's go store. Ambush. Whenever an attack phase ends, and mites are generated. Accuracy, useless, completely useless that. Bullet size and bullet damage for movement speed, definitely yes. Uh, this uh, might as well place down a mine, who cares. Accuracy, useless, bullet damage and bullet size, yes. Bullet speed, no. Let's go. Um, yeah, I don't wanna pay for rerolls. As again, I might find the legendary there and not be able to use it. Let's get the bullets in. Now let's get them out. Wait, can I get like a mini small circle with dense bullets? I think this is a mini small circle with dense bullets. Elite grenade. When I do an elite fire grenade, fire rate higher, yes. With no downside. Burst. Whenever you destroy an enemy, generate explosions. Yes. Let's get the free reroll as it is free. HP. Bullets will split at 70% range. Yes, I want this. We are locking down. More range, obviously, and more max HP. We are locking down for this. Let's see what will happen when bullets will blink and split. I think the blink is happening at... Where's the blink happening at? It's... Um, I thought it was something... Quantum bullets. It's happening at 60 range. So first it's gonna blink, and then it's gonna split. It's as if I have this blink on every single one of my builds. Maybe I should stop getting these. The blink. Although the blink is actually helping because I have bullets floating around and destroying enemies. So this blink... Oh, wait a minute. I just realized. Bullets that blink, I can still move them. Wow, this is so cool, man. Let's buy this. Let's get a free reroll. Almighty bullet. I'm locking down again. Accuracy shooters. Bullet speed. Range is nice. Bullet speed's bad, but let's buy the range. Let's go. So now my bullets, do you see this? They they blink and then they split like to four little bullets. This is so awesome. This is so awesome. Would be nice to see the same version without the blinking. I would really like to see that. This is gonna be so strong. Uh, let's uh, reroll for free. 
Golden Legendary, a new slot will add it for only appearing legendaries there. Shield capacity whenever you take damage. Let's go with both of those. Lucky. Let's go with both of those. So let's lock down again. I don't care about locking down in this particular case because, to be honest, I can reroll for free every round. So, okay, up the challenge like, not twice. I will not upgrade the challenge twice in the same run. Uh, let's get the last hope. I'm not gonna roll for free. Actually, let's upgrade the chance twice. Maybe you lose. Maybe you lose. Who knows? Maybe I'm risking too much. Maybe this is a Joe. Uh, an enemy tank me. Okay, I can control everything from my little palace in the middle. Look at this. Bullet splitting all around. 136. Now we're gaining some money. Shield capacity plus two. Wow. Let's get the free reroll. I don't care about movement speed. Range more. Yeah. Bullets will change direction even. Yeah. <laughs> YOLO. Every time bullet rebounds, the bullet damage more. Uh, my bullets don't rebound. Fire rate, recoil, movement speed. I would say yes to that. Let's lock it down for the fire rate. Actually, I don't think it's worth it. Just for a fire rate upgrade. I should have upped the difficulty for sure. So now my bullets almost no longer are around me. Let's gather every bullet close to me. Yeah. It's too close, I think. Over here is a good choice. Yeah, this is a good cycle. Store. Watcher. I don't even need to be moving anymore. Range more. Grenades. Uh, I don't care about the grenades, but the range is really important. When you're at full HP, you do a bunch of damage. Yes. Um, let's also buy this. Free roll. Range less. More crit rate. Not really important. Reverse direction of recoil. That's not something that actually I care about. Split engine. Whenever it splits, it does more damage. You know what? Let's take this for the fire rate. Because the recoil is not something I care about. Let's lock this down because I want this. And let's up the challenge one more. So right now I should have extreme attack speed. Yep. Nothing can even come close to us. And random bullets are like splitting all around and going to random directions. So what now? What is happening now? First of all, let's go to the store. Let's buy what I wanted. Split engine. And um, nothing else, pretty much. Let's get the free reroll. Gravitation, fire rate, and knockback, but direction of knockback is. Who cares? There is no knockback. I don't care. I, I, I have 0% knockback. And it's still 0, as you can see here. Less range, definitely not. Thorns, whenever you touch enemies, no. Uh, none of them. I don't want any of them. So what is happening here is that at 40% range, they go to random directions. So they either go outside or inside and then they blink and then they split. So I have like a mini army. And if I bring everything very close to me, you will see that there are a bunch of explosions happening. I think this range, no, it's too, too far away. I need like, this cycle is pretty good. This is a good cycle. Let's go chance level up. Until we lose the game. What? I'm destroying enemies. Yeah, not even close to losing the game here. So most likely challenge level is gonna go up again. This is a boss room, right? Yep. It was a boss fight and it's over now. What do you guys think you're doing? What do you guys think you're doing? Let's maybe make the circle a smidge smaller. The smaller the circle is, the more con concentrated my bullets are. So fire rate less recoil 24 percent fire rate is what this thing gives me and range range is always a yes thorn wall whenever an enemy touches the wall they lose life nope bullets instantly change to bullet damage and size at 60 range yes so the moment they start going away from me giant bullet movement speed and range both of them a range is really important forget that bullet damage range is important critical rate is also important but 80 percent damage let's say yes let's take a reroll here Fire rate, yes, obviously. When you are about to lose, you still survive. Let's get the crit rate. That was a bad pickup. Fire rate, definitely not. Let's go for the second life. And let's upgrade the challenge level one more time. Let's see how we fare at this level. Still destroying most of the enemies in one shot. Uh, although, no, this time enemies do actually come close to me. Not that they really survive, but... Oh, whoa, 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 stay away, stay away. Let's run around. Let's spin around at the speed of sound and make my bullets fly. Store. 
range fire rate and bullet damage yes obviously bullet damage missiles less range forget that bullets will stop for half a second does that even make sense should i try this i don't think it's a good idea uh although i can try it i can try it let's get the fury roll two legendaries whenever they defeat the lead uh fire rate and accuracy yeah let's let's lock this down we got some pretty upgrades here i also want this let's go so the bullets freeze and then continue moving i don't even know what's happening let's go another level up actually the enemies are gonna get triple hp it's a bit too dangerous let's stay where we are if i one shot the normal enemies then we can talk but i think i'm not even one shotting the normal enemies no i am one shotting the normal enemies am i i don't know am i i see some at 70 but i think they're at 70 because of the explosions well this is becoming dangerous as i see it so i don't see the the upside of having the bullets freeze but it's fun so who cares legendary upgrade crit rate and accuracy might as well keep and uh movement speed when you move you're a bit bigger uh keep i guess who cares movement speed recoil and every definitely useless get the free reroll knock back roost capacity and regain shield perfect this is like such a good upgrade fire rate for movement speed yes stop this let's go let's go challenge level up i have the second life anyway so if i lose i lose where am i uh oh let's close the bullets in let's get the bullet uh oh uh oh uh oh get get away from me okay i lost my second life and uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna lose because um, yeah I'm gonna lose here because I overplayed my hand and because I cannot get out of this corner yep I died it's okay it's okay I learned from my mistakes even though I lost I'm uh, I'm still okay with it I mean it was like two stages before winning and uh, the reason I lost is obviously because I overplayed my hand so there's that i guess rapid magic stats change bullet damage and bullet speed wait so if i if i use this i want to see what will happen oh so this is just better yeah this is just better there is an enemy inside the field as you can see when the cycle is big there is a, there are gaps more gaps when there's than when the cycle is small anyway i'm uh, i'm not gonna play this i think wait what elastic wall should i play this let's lock this down to be honest i don't think i'm gonna what where are we in the video we at the 23 minute mark you know what i can play this with the elastic wall I should not have started the run if I wasn't gonna play it. Store, right? Let's go with Elastic Wall. Crit effect. Knockback useless. Let's upgrade the challenge level. To A. Although I didn't even get damage. So range and accuracy. Range is good. Accuracy useless. Fire rate. I want that. Let's lock down. Okay, enemy came into our container. Container, containment room, whatever. Did I equip the rune? I think I equipped the rune. I'm pretty sure I equipped my new rune. How does it look? <laughs> what is this? Well, at least I'm not losing my bullets. Here and reroll. Uh, bullet speed less, bullet damage higher, bullet size higher. You know what? I'm gonna lock again. That's why I don't like locking down the, the game. Bullet damage but less fire rate. Yeah, it's worth it. Even if I get less damage. If I, if I one-shot enemies, then it's definitely worth it. It's a bit weird. The, the mage is a bit weird. 
I'm, I'm gonna try to not... I'm gonna try to have split bullets, but to not have the blinking bullets for once. Maybe that's gonna make this better. Let's buy this and let's just unlock and not reroll this time. Fire rate and bullet damage. Oh, this is a one-time thing. Let's reroll. That would have been insane if it wasn't a one-time thing. Uh-oh. So the good thing is that even if I go to the wall, I still don't lose my bullets. So now I have less to fear. At least that is something. It's, it's something. 69, nice amount of money. Elastic bullet again. More range, less bullet damage. Actually, this is a bullet rebound from stuck enemies. Yes. Bullet damage, bullet size. Whenever you hit an enemy with a bullet or missile, you have a chance to fire a missile. Yes. Bullets become faster gradually. I will say no to that. I don't want my bullets to become faster, as they will most likely just uh, dissipate faster, if, if what I'm understanding is correct. So now my bullets also bounce, very nice. Uh, bullet speed becomes slower, but bullet size becomes bigger. Yes. Fire rate, obviously yes. Damage and crit rate, yes. And I'm not gonna reroll again. Let's upgrade the challenge level. Uh, okay, I should avoid max plus 5. Max plus the 7000% damage boost is what I should avoid. See my bullets flying off whenever they hit an enemy, they, they bounce and go off the stage. Store overload device, fire rate more for 1 HP, yes. Effect bullet speed and range, yes. Range is the important aspect there. Let's go for this. It's also my make our cycle a bit bigger. As you can see, the, the thing that's shooting out the cycle is shooting a lot faster. Like a lot faster. Let's make the sh size even bigger. Let's make it. Yeah, we have a huge circle here. Telescope, range and accuracy. Range, yes. Good rate. A new slot for legendaries. Dedication. Yes, I will buy dedication. Two life, I don't care. I'm, I should be one shotting everything. Nothing is gonna even come remotely close to us. Nothing. Good day, sir. That's the power of dedication. Store. Syringe, whenever an attack phase ends, get adrenaline. Adrenaline is gonna cost me two life. I would really like to buy this, but I need more HP and nothing gives me HP here and I'm gonna lose when I buy this, so... Bullets reverse direction. I'm gonna lose if I pick this up. <laughs> Precision strike, bullet accuracy, fire rate for recoil, obviously. I would really like to buy this, but I just need one more health. Adrenaline costs you two life every round, so it's it's gonna make me lose. Bullets will live. I would also like to buy this, but <laughs> it's gonna make me have like one point where I won't have bullets. Engineer, bullet damage for less range, double the size of explosion damage, that's useless. Fire rate, obviously. Bullets will get size. Might as well. Elastic bullet and elastic wall. Yes. Let's go. Did I upgrade the difficulty? What did I do? It feels like I upgraded the difficulty. Boss got destroyed. Okay, if the boss got destroyed, I'm pretty sure... How, how big can the cycle become? This is the biggest. The cycle cannot become bigger than that. Wait, I tried to not touch anything. So that the cycle is clean. Let's maybe just make it a bit smaller. As simple as that. Max HP, thank you. Every time you buy an upgrade, the corresponding slot will be filled. Yes. Bullet damage. I trust he's useless. I'm not gonna do the pill. Challenge. Level up. Let's go. Okay, still nothing is even remotely surviving. I control the middle. Rain some fire rate and knockback. Yes. Accuracy is useful. Bullet damage and crit rate. Yes. Range is useful. Fire rate. Max HP. More for useless stats. So let's buy them. Uh, I like this for this character. Bullet damage. Crit effect. HP. Crit rate. Bad for this character. Range. Max HP. Range. Fire rate. Range. Bullet damage. Max HP. And out of money. And let's get the free reroll. Let's also up the level again. And maybe even again. Now we're very close to where we lost the last time. 
I'm not one-shotting the elites anymore. So that is something to keep in mind. Okay, we're gonna stick here for a bit. Overheal whenever you... Yeah, might as well, it gives us a shield. Yep, crit effect. And that's gonna be it. I'm gonna stick to 69. A nice amount of points. Let's close this down a bit and let's fight. But I remember that elites actually survive the onslaught. Otherwise, we are pretty safe. Store. Syringe. Now I can buy this. Now I can buy that. Gradually gain speed. Gradually uh, gain speed. I don't want speed. Reverse direction of recoil. This is, um, as I said before, it has no effect. Good effect. Max HP. Good effect. Range. Damage. Crit rate. HP. 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 Damage. HP. Crit effect. Crit effect. Fire rate. Crit rate. Crit rate was useless. Good thing I didn't have money. I think I can go a level higher, but let's test this difficulty first. Okay, I am doing extremely high amounts of damage again. Yes, I can go a difficulty higher. Although the elites are surviving barely. Yeah, enemies seem to be surviving a bit. HP, what is this? Sticky grenade? No. Imminent monument. More, less HP for damage. Crit effect. Ah, let's take it. Crit effect, bullet damage, range, HP, damage, HP, damage, range, effect, damage, effect, damage, range. Rate is useless. Let's go up a challenge level. Okay, the next one is the, the dangerous change. So we are gonna stick to this for a moment. The only way we are going off to the next difficulty is if we're one-shotting the elites. We don't okay the boss got destroyed i think we can go to the next one and if we lose we lose bullet damage for fire rate 80 percent i would say yes crit rate and i just see crit rates nice crit rates useless bullet damage for losing life each second 60 percent losing one damage every for every three slash n seconds in the attack phase you will deal one damage yourself Okay, only lead and bosses can detonate mines. Bullet damage plus 30. This, uh, first of all, let's take this. Bullet damage. I would say let's also take this. I wanna, I wanna see that happen. Good rate useless. Let's, uh, let's actually reroll. Bullet size for more recoil. Let's make the bullets bigger, yes. Is there anything better? Whenever your HP is equal or less than 20 shield recovery's effect will be doubled. If it gave shield... All bullet changes upgrade no longer affect bullet size. Bullet change upgrades hold normal bullets. Yes. Bullet size for recoil. Well, let's get the free reroll. Let's see how this will roll. Whoa, we do a bunch of damage. Ah, this is a joke still. I'm losing life from the immolation. But it doesn't matter. As we won. Should I go to the next one? Should I go to the one that... Double-edged sword! Yes, now I go to the next one for sure. Bullet damage. Crit rate and effect. 40% effect for some damage. Accuracy. More HP, less blood size and speed. The wall bounce enemies knock real shield will be cut in half. Yeah, I don't care about those two, so... Let's get some... Let's get like a lot damage and some fire rate. Let's go to the dangerous difficulty level. The last time I lost from this. I cannot move. I have no movement speed. Yep. I cannot move. Let's go. Wherever the game gets us. I cannot move from here. If enemies come inside, we're toast. Survived. Nice. It was a joke even. Let's go to the next difficulty level. Damage. Increase. Double edged sword. Yes. Bullets against speed, who cares? Accuracy, who cares? Bullet damage, crit effect, fire rate, range, not movement speed. Let's not reroll. Let's go. I cannot move. So if anything comes close to. Ah, da, 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 da. Okay. I brought in my destruction. Oh, I'm losing three life per second from the immolation. Three life per. per yeah, per second. I need some max HP. Yeah, give me this. I cannot move. <laughs> uh, first refresh will be free. 
This is never gonna pay back in time. Body size higher, max HP higher. Yes. <laughs> Accuracy useless, crit rate useless. Let's reroll by hand. Quantum bullets. I'm not gonna pick this up. Triple shot. Bullets will split. Yes. <laughs> Uh, power-ups. I can't even pick up the power-ups up. Bit rate. Useless. It's not by anything. Look at this. I have my little cycle, and then I have a semi-cycle. Can I have everything close to me? How how big is the semi-cycle gonna be if everything is close to me? Oh, it's, it's pretty small. But it's fun. Let's make it a bit bigger. I think this is a good... Let's, let's see how the semi-cycle is gonna form. Yes, I like this. Look at this. It's as if we're a, a mandala. I don't think anything is gonna come even close to us. I lost HP. I lose HP. Let's make this a bit bigger because we need to get rid of some units. I'm gonna lose. Emulation's gonna do us in. I think this is... This is a good size. Yeah, because... I want to be able to touch everything, and I also have, like, bouncing bullets, so... I'm not gonna lose any bullet with this store. Unfortunately, no. Uh, I don't know. Bullet size, accuracy. Um, could, could... Uh, let's go with second life. Crit rate, useless. Bullet size and accuracy, this is not gonna give us anything. Basic package, yeah, let's get everything. Let's get two shield capacity, pretty much for free. I would like to get a bunch of life, but let's first see if I can find something that's a bit more important. Soup rebound. Every time a bullet rebounds, it's bullet damage and bullet speed goes higher. But less bullet speed. I like this. I think I have two rebounds, so let's lock this down. Yeah, lock this down. Let's buy the fire rate and uh, let's lock it down for the super bounce. Yeah, let's go. Okay, elites are still getting one shot. So, I should have had a higher difficulty level. I won. There is no way I'm losing. This is so nice. It's, I'm happy I ran twice. I'm happy I ran another time. This was a nice run in the end. So, I I could see the wizard being one of the characters that I would go into uh, wanderer mode with. You know what? I'm gonna play with every character on easy normal mode. And when I actually find the characters I think are awesome for... The wonder mode, then I'm gonna go there. What did I pick? Bullet damage higher, bullet speed is higher. And the well, fire is fireball. The magic gun will always be in the nearest position and cannot be pushed further, but you get movement speed and fire rate. How does this look like? And even more bullet speed and damage? So, how would this actually look like? I just wanna see how this looks like. <laughs> I'm the flame of doom. And is that even powerful? I want to see if that is powerful. I'm not going to play anymore, but I'm just going to test. Oh, look at this. I am a fireball. Yeah, I can tank everything. I'm attacking so fast at the speed of sound. Anyway, that that's going to be it. Let's give up. Yes, let's yes, give up. What does it, does it give damage? It gives fire rate, 150% fire rate, so that's the that's the trick that's happening. So all the characters have actually things like these. So whenever user spend one additional HP by shooting the duration over the 3%. So um, yeah, a bunch of units are not the thing you are. There is a bunch of things to unlock in this game, it's not only just uh, going through. So I think I will continue going through every character in normal mode, and uh, and I will see what I will do after that. So, yeah, hopefully you guys liked the run. If you did, drop a like, helping out the channel. And if you would like to help me out even more, there is always Patreon for that. Otherwise, that's going to be it for today. Thanks for watching and see you guys around.